hey guys welcome back again this is MJ today I will show you how to give password to open your MS files like MS Word, Excel, PowerPoint if you are using 2003, uh, C1, 10, 13 or uh, even 16 so I will show all these things in quick way so first uh, I am going to open a, a Word file 2003 so in Word file just if you want to set the password just click on tool and click on option and here click on security that's it and just uh, type your password like uh, 123 for example okay if you if you want you can give the modify password so that's it just set your password and click okay and confirm your password again 123 okay so now I'm going to close this file word file okay so it is asking to save the changes so that's it this for 2003 if you are using 2007 office 2007 word file so there is no tool option given in this uh, office 2007 so just you need to press ctrl s to save like this and give any uh, file name like what 2007 and after you give the file name here you can see the tool option click here and click on journal and type your password like uh, 123 and click ok and 123 that's it save so this is the 2003 if you already save your file and you want to give the password in 2007 or 10 13 or 16 so you have to do one thing uh, just go to save as here and you have to make a new file to give the password and i will use the like uh, final like this and now you can give the password like just uh, go to tools and general option and then set your password like this so if you create already uh, created the already file in uh, 2007 or, th or 13 or 16 so you have to save it uh, save as take as a save as and then give the password and the same thing will apply here in the 2016 i am using 2016 right now so just uh, control s plus control s uh, to save the file and click the browse and desktop and give the file name like 2016 and here go to tool and in journal and give the password like one two three whatever and click ok ok confirm the password and click ok and save so that's it so if you already save the file uh, if you have already created the file in uh, 2016 so same thing will apply uh, just go to your file and click on save as and make a new, new file to give the password if your password is uh, if your file not protected in the password so you can make a new file like uh, one and here go to general modify and again give the password so i have showed the both way uh, you can create your password before uh, uh, saving the file or you can create the password after you create the file so the thing is you have to save as your file to give the password to unpassword file so the same thing will apply here in uh, excel like uh, just uh, save as here and file name give the file name and go tool and journal and check the give the password to open like this and in 2016 click the save and choose your location and go to tool and click on journal option and give the your password uh, if you have if you already saved the file so uh, take the save as and uh, give the password in the powerpoint the same thing will apply in 2003 you can easily do this by going the tools and option and set here the, set here the password like this okay and uh, in the 2007 and 10 or 13 or 16 you have to save click on save and here click on tool and give the password like this general tools or if you already saved you have to save as your file once again you have to save as the file and then you can give the password and here in the 2016 same thing here go to save as or save whatever tools and give the file your password that's it it's very simple to give the password i have don't be confused about the all these things because i have showed the all these things like 2003 2007 and 10 13 and 16 
and I have used uh, Word, Excel, PowerPoint. So all all this thing has same uh, procedure to give the password, but little tricky. So if you I the main thing I have I am uh, explaining here, if you already created the file without password, so you have to uh, click on the Save As and make a new file and then uh, give the password in 2007. In 2003, you can give the password anytime after or before you are creating the file. So I hope you understand and it will help you. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.